Hey guys, as always we have a new package, and inside we have a bag of painting gear including two damaged Wagner Flexio painting guns. And once I made sure they're not shorted, we can plug one in to see that exactly nothing happens. So let's open one up. We need to remove the filter cover, the screws and the plastic under which we can find one more screw. First, I made sure the button works and tested the fuse. Since everything checks out, let's plug it in and test the voltage on the motor. With everything looking good, we need to dig deeper. Since the plastic is glued to the motor case, we need to use a rotary tool to cut the plastic. And with one more seal off, we need to cut open the hat of the motor. And unbend the tabs holding the rotor in. We can test it now by placing our probes on the brush holders, which also act as the point of contact. As we measure the continuity, we should measure a roughly stable resistance as we go through the different windings. And as you can see, that's far from what we have. Before I show you how to fix this, I decided to open the other one up to see if we have the same problem. And as you can see, the rotor inside this one is completely broken as it seems to have fallen apart. So to fix the issue with the first rotor, we'll need to ensure proper contact between the rotor and the brushes. Due to the paint that got inside, the brushes seem to be stuck to the holders, not making a proper contact. I push the retaining spring to the side and remove the brush assembly. I then scrape the excess paint and as you can see the brush now moves freely. I also use some IPA to clean the contact points and use a scraper to remove any gunk from in between them. And if we repeat the test now, you can see that we actually get a stable reading. All that's left now is to reassemble it. And after plugging it in, we can actually hear the motor spinning now and it blows air. So before we test it further, it's also good to clean at least one of the painting heads. And with it looking much better, we can test it now. Thanks for watching. If there is anything else you'd like to see fixed, let me know down in the comments and subscribe if you enjoyed.